Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am the Grand Cat, and today we're going to finish off the heroic. <laughs> uh, you can see we're already on the Jimmy Uso. We're going to finish off the heroic Andrade. We are very, very close to it, as you can see there. And we've got ourselves our Stone Cold, our Royal Rumble 24 Stone Cold. And speaking of Stone Cold, I'm recording this on March 15th. Tomorrow is March 16th. And if you're in America, you know that the month comes first. So tomorrow's date is going to be ah, uh, 316, son. And in honor of it, we have been given a brand new quest, which there's five things to do here. Once you've reset the draft board 40 times, you'll get yourself a Bret Hart in honor of the Blood From A Stone match that made Stone Cold's career. If you acquire 15 tickets, you will get, once it loads, a uh, supercard. I think supercard needs fixing. Oh my goodness, there you go. <laughs> supercard. Hmm. Having a little bit of problem there. But it contains a good old Stone Cold Sun. If you use your super move 10 times, you will get two gold fusion currency tokens. If you win a match using a Stone Cold Steve Austin, you'll get two rarity draft picks. And then if you play a game in the event mode or in Money in the Bank, you'll get two forging crystals. But if you do all of this within the next five days and four days, 22 hours, then you'll get the bottom line quest rewards, which is going to give you an exclusive... Stone Cold Steve Austin. Oh, hell yeah. What, what, what? <laughs> so that is very, very cool. Because Stone Cold said so. What? So that is very, very cool. I don't know how you get the pro of them. That's going to give you one of them, certainly. We also have the hype train. We'll do that a little bit later on as well. And you can see that the Bray Wyatt tickets, the Bray Wyatt collection has now disappeared. Instead, uh, we currently have the Fusion Chamber, which let's go ahead and claim that. We got a Kofi Kingston, which uh, was not <laughs> particularly fantastic. Now we're going to start a new one of these. Uh, what I did there was, that was this one. If it will let you look at it. There we go. Um, which gives you a chance at any of the WrestleMania cards, but a Tundra, Crucible, Noir, Detention, or Tempest, of course. We got the Detention card out of that there. However, if you save up three blue and three red, then you have the slightly higher chance where the weakest you can get is a Crucible or a Tundra, but I think it's the same percentage chance to get the WrestleMania cards. So I think it's, it doesn't tell you what the percentage chance is, unfortunately because normally there'd be a little eye thing up here that gives you the percentage number underneath them, but I think it might be better to go for the bell than it is to go for this one, because the spotlight is just going to take longer to get into them, and you just want more chances to try and get those WrestleMania cards. So, without any further ado, let us continue. Let's move on. We are also very close to the end of Battle Pass as well. You can see there that we're only one away from getting the, the Pro... Jade Cargo. So without any further ado, let's get in here. Let's take on Jimmy Uso and get ourselves a double heroic Andrade. So let's see we have a left arrow. So we're just going to use the left arrow and the two down arrows. It was the up and down arrow. That's not what I want to see, but we've got three of them. Now we're going to have the right arrow. Which we got three again, and we'll use the next highest toughness. There we go, we've got 23,000. And that is us. We are done. We have got ourselves our double heroic... Our second heroic Andrade. We will get the double heroic once they are proed together. But that is us. We are finished. I'm going to screenshot that one. I never know what the thumbnail is going to be when I make these videos. Now let's just dust those. Always check to make sure that you aren't accidentally dusting your event card. That's why I always check. Unfortunately, don't need that in the war card, so we're just going to get rid of that. 
And there we go. We have now finished the Giants Unleashed. Uh, let's go and, you know what, I'm going to go into the quest here. And I think the Stone Cold is the most interesting thing. So let's just take a quick screenshot of him. Because that may be the thumbnail as well. I never know with these things. But let's jump into Hype Train. And let's see if we can get lucky once again. We're going to draw here. So 565 is 16, and I don't think 16 is enough. I think we're going to need a 6 or a 7 there. Yep, that's only going to do that. So we're going to put the 5 in this one instead, and then draw again. So is a 6 enough? No, it is not. But if we put two 6s in here... That also doesn't do it. Oh no, we, we needed some sevens in here. Okay, we can do this at least. We might not get the hype six because we've got some low numbers there. Okay, a seven does put us into hype two. And I think unfortunately we're just going to have to live with the hype ones so we're not going to get the hype six because we got some unfortunate cards there we're just going to claim reward because we go if we do draw everything is going to be over hyped so it's going to claim rewards there and claim it on four of six let's see we've got an aj styles let's see the detention card coming up more aj styles natalia detention gargano finn balor braun Strowman, naomi Roman Reigns, JD McDonough, Carl Anderson, and Andre the Giant. Unfortunately, none of those are helpful to us in the slightest. Of course, we can at least make a pro elite Natalia. And other than that, SummerSlam 17, AJ Styles. Yep, not the best pack opening in the world, I must say. So, what um, what is the next thing we must do? I think the next thing is we want to try and do this quest. So the easiest way to do these is probably to do the Giants Unleashed because they are nice, fast and easy. Just do 25 of them, there should be no problems. In order to do the win a match using a Stone Cold Steve Austin card, you literally just make sure that your Stone Cold Steve Austins are the best cards and you just throw them in. Uh, one of the best ways of doing this is if you go into PvP and you switch over to a Royal Rumble and you can see here I've got the, my two best cards as being Finn Balor and uh, The Fiend but if we swap these out and we look for some Stone Cold Steve Austins now I think it's been a little while since we've had a good Stone Cold Steve Austin card so it might take a little while to scroll through here and find one We've got the Royal Rumble 24, uh, Stone Cold actually, that we pulled from the event. And the next highest one from there. And unfortunately we are into the, the lower ranked ones. Rather unfortunately. So it looks like I've only got the one Stone Cold Steve Austin as a matter of fact. So um, I may need to do this quest here to try and get more Stone Cold. By acquiring 15 tickets that will give me another stone cold so that's how to do them that's how to get these uh use your super move you just keep playing the game and then just use your move whenever you've got the chance acquire tickets it'll generally take about two days to do it uh, unfortunately i've already used up all the tickets today so i need to wait for those to refresh and then reset the draft board you'll just get by just playing the game and that will give you if you're a royal Rumble 24 a guaranteed very special Royal Rumble 24 Stone Cold Steve Austin. Now I'm not sure where the pro is going to come from this because at the moment it looks like you can only get the one of it. Maybe there'll be a second quest that will come up a little bit later or maybe it will show up in the in the store over here, in the superstore perhaps or maybe there will be something like a hype train or something that will give you the chance at getting the Stone Cold. I'm not sure how they're planning to do it just yet. But there we are, folks. That is it for this little video. I really hope that you all enjoyed. 
And if you did enjoy it, please give me a like, share and subscribe. If you are subscribed, make sure you click that notification icon so you can see when more of these glorious little videos come up. And we shall see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.